beyond the civility of meticulous manicured memoriam, beneath the fluttering flags of national pride, by the buried, lost, and tortured dreams of countless souls whose widows cried. The wind flutters in my ears and eyes, noisy, like some troublesome ghost, battering intent and demanding attention, caught in the sails of sand surfers, which flap and flit intermittent, calling cries and shouts of joy as the gulls which hop and buffet along the bright beach. Normandy's beaches stretch like a stage, enacting family dramas, and I watch my children play, free in the fresh sun blast of day. Limbs torn and flayed in flight scatter, scattered, the detritus of death in war, washed up in a tide of man, blood, bloodied, bloody, it washes up the beach and thunders into grey. Each man's push is spent, a cry for each step over the sand which collapses at his feet. Tidal, the battle crash pulls back and brings him down. My son with a ball plays in the sun and the sun shines, effulgent. A million billion grains of peace in the sun-soaked holiday glare and the bloody memory wound washes clean. Somewhere nearby lie the buried bits of history, honored for their passing, glorified by the bronze beauty of a boy whose frozen pirouette reminds me that he did not die. His torso twists, immobilized, the spirit of youth dances for squandered men, immortalized in row upon row of bullet-battered bodies, buried. Personal loss is lost in the rows of each cross and buried, bruised lives overseas. A thousand ghosts of grandfathers walk upon the beach and each one misses the ball that's kicked or tumbles in the breaking surf unwet. They leave the lovers to the quiet places, lost to everyone but themselves, and the shadow that sweeps across the sand with the painful thoughts of what was not. <laughs>